This is Mark Gregorich with Fidelity Title, and I want to do a quick tutorial on how to use the new Walking Farm tool that we've recently released in Title Force. So what you want to do is first is launch Title Force, touch on More, go to Neighborhood Farms, touch on the farm area, and then what Title Force is going to do is it's going to zoom into the area that you're currently at. So I'm going to reposition my, my area here, my map, into a neighborhood. On the lower left-hand corner, you can see a little polygon tool. So I touch on the polygon tool, which allows me to draw a polygon on the screen. And I'm just touching each area and to draw the polygon. When I'm done, I just touch the first one that I've laid on the screen, and it'll close my polygon. I touch on Apply. And if I want to add additional filters, I touch on the little filter icon, and I can add additional filters. I touch on Get Report Count. And then what Title Force is going to do is it's going to go back and say, in that area that I just drew on the screen, there's 123 farm records. It also gives me the turnover rate of 1.6%. What that means is the last 12 months, 1.6% of the homes have changed hands. I can click on Get Reports. And what Title Force is next going to do is ask me, do I want it where I need to name it? So once the name comes up, I touch on OK, and now it gives me the ability to actually export this as a CSV file, every labels, or walking farm. So if I touch on walking farm, it's now going to sort the list by street address of all those 123 properties. If you look at this one here where it says Nancy Smith has a three bedroom, two bath, 1300 square foot, it actually has a little circle with a cross through it, indicating that this is an absentee owner. The other thing I can do is I can touch on the little house. And when I touch on the little house, you'll see at the bottom that it comes up with saying contact it. And I'm just sliding through these, um, saying not home or not interested. So as you're walking from door to door, you can actually go in and rate each one of these. So I'm going to turn this into this one to green. And then maybe I knocked on this one here. So I touch on that house and I scroll and saying not home. So I can go in and rate each one of these um, and categorize them. So maybe I'll set this one up as a prospect. And I say done. So I can go in and rate each one of those. If I want to get more detailed information, all I have to do is click on the main area by the address here, and it's going to bring up more detailed on each one of these. And it also gives me the ability to actually type in notes. The other thing I can do is if I go back to the list screen, where there's a little globe in the upper right-hand corner, if I touch on the little globe, it's now going to give me my walking farm laid out on the screen. And at the bottom it says, draw a walking order. So if I touch draw a walking order, I can actually draw on the screen. Um, and you can see the orange line appearing behind all the little stick pins. And this is the, what's, how it's actually going to order the walking form that I just drew. And now that walking form list is now sorted based upon what I've just drawn on the screen. Lastly, what I can do is I can export this where I can send this to myself. So the little on the top, the little box with an arrow pointing out of it gives me the ability to save this as a CSV file, or I can email a farm report. And if I touch on email farm report, what um, Title Force will do is actually send you an email message of all of those notes and comments and everything else that you've done as a PDF file and send it off to your email inbox. I hope you like the new features of Fidelity Title Force and look forward to uh, working with you in the future.